sunset, high in a lofty tower in the prairie lands of Champaign County, Muhammad, Illinois. And an echo chamber. An echo chamber for a bit of vocal exercise. <clears throat> I need the every heart most gracious Lord. No tender voice like thine can be so afford. I need thee, oh, I need thee. Every hour I need thee, oh, bless me now, my Savior. I come to thee. I need thee every hour. Stay thou near by. Temptations lose their power when thou doesn't do too well, but we caught the 
the sunset on that song. And it's interesting because, interesting. Um, I am convinced that since I was in the womb of a mother who was playing hymns in the Lutheran church, I was aware of pitch and sound and hymns before I was pushed through the birth canal. I wonder what I was doing as those bass pipes were vibrating the entire building. You know, and, uh, and it's funny because my mom um, my mom had a, uh, <laughs> okay, we can go upstairs. <laughs> my mom had a, a, uh, a tone deafness problem. Had some kind of measles or chicken pox or something that made her tone, uh, tone deaf, um, when in her youth and, uh, <laughs> and in her youth, she was tone deaf and, I kind of know that when I when she was singing, I as a little child was probably like aware of the fact that she was having problems with pitch because she couldn't see, feel the tone, sort of. And uh, <laughs> and uh, praise Jesus, And so I have this. I have this feeling in my spirit that I really loan, learned tone and singing in the womb, first of all. And, uh, and then I was actually listening to a recording of my mom telling stories, and, and she said that um, my dad, who adopted me in the womb, uh, met her on the Ocean City Boardwalk out in front of the Music Pier, which is a favorite meeting place. And, uh, and he talked to her and he said, um, when can I see you again tomorrow? <clears throat> and she said, uh, well, I'll be at the Lutheran Church tomorrow in Ocean City because I have to play the organ for the early service. <laughs> My father's, my father is like getting ready to go to Lutheran seminary, and uh, and so their first actual planned date was the early service at a Lutheran church where my mom was playing the organ. I mean, come on, that was actually before she got pregnant with me at Duke College of Nursing back in the days where they told you you are you are. You're working with the physical body, but also the invisible soul. So you have to be as prayed up as you are studied up. And um, so that's why as I sing these hymns in this echo chamber and cry my eyes out, you got the second segment. The first segment I, I sang, uh, the, the three hymns for today are In the Garden, um, I come to the garden of home. Um, and, uh, and I heard an old, old story. <laughs> Victory in Jesus. And the, the one that you heard. Um, and, but I actually started out because, like, you know, I mean, the Luke Lutheran thing is so rough and... You know, it's like, hello, you know, Luther, Germans. Wow, look at this sky, man. It's so nice. Um, <clears throat> the whole Lutheran thing is so rough. So the first thing that I sang actually was, Shalom Haverim, Shalom Haverim, Shalom. Shalom, let it let it Shalom, shalom, happy sunset. 